Hello everybody and welcome to Uprising 144K. I'm Hydrogen Man. So today's video is about Crohn's disease and really more of a story that I actually heard. Somebody who contacted me and they were letting me know how hydrogen was working for them in regards to Crohn's disease. Now they were using the Hydrofix. They were actually using the 2019 version, the premium edition. They were doing both the water and the hydrogen gas inhalation. They actually started getting pretty decent benefit at around one to two months into it. However, this particular person had a really hard time just keeping up with it. They didn't want to stop drinking soda pop. They didn't want to continue using the hydrogen water or the hydrogen gas inhalation. They felt that it was just too much work for them. I thought, you know, it's pretty easy to keep up with a regimen in regards to hydrogen water as compared to doing a very, very healthy diet. The biggest, most interesting thing that I observed is that they were actually doing, you know, relatively well. They were, they were having an increase as far as how well that they were doing. But when they stopped using the hydrogen, it was probably about two weeks, I believe, roughly, they had a major crash, a really big downfall. And I think ultimately what happened is they didn't realize how much hydrogen was doing for them. And this is something that I've observed a lot with people in general who don't think that hydrogen is doing much for them. And ultimately they get off of it and then they have a huge crash and they didn't realize how much it was supporting their good health. I think it's simple, <coughs> excuse me. I think the simple fact is, is that hydrogen was certainly doing something for this particular person. I really wish they would have been able to stick with it longer for like six to eight months. I could see that there was benefit, but you know, again, a lot of times hydrogen, depending on the person, depending on what it is they're going through, can have a steady, you know, increase as far as how well they're doing. And I think this happens a lot because people don't realize that when they get sick, they don't get sick overnight typically. It's usually something that happens gradually. And I've noticed that hydrogen works relatively gradually also. So I kind of hope this kind of helps people, you know, shed a little light on how hydrogen works. But ultimately guys, it did appear that hydrogen was actually working really good for something like Crohn's disease. But again, it was kind of slow going and I think a lot of people have a difficult time with that. But unfortunately, that's just the way that it works. And so I hope that you guys found this information helpful. As usual, give the video a thumbs up if you liked it. Don't forget to subscribe and share. And that's it guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time on the next one.